uh, there's a couple things. So we're down here at the uh, St. Catharines Library here. And uh, just hanging in the show. There it is. You're very welcome. How you doing today? Oh, honey, better be a sin. How you doing? What's that? I don't smoke. Oh, okay. There we go. Welcome to the library in St. Catharines. Let's see what's going on here. I don't see anything of yet. Do we need... Oh, here it is. <clears throat> How are you doing today, sir? Dad, where are you going? I'm inside to take a look. I'm oh, sorry, excuse me. Excuse me. How are you doing today? Hey, need to leave now, sir. I'm just here for private rides. No, you got Why? Because they don't, it's, a, it's a special event. You have to have something to get out, like... Uh, an ID or something like that. An idea? I have an idea. I'm a, a yeah, tax paying citizen of no, no, St. No. Catharines. Why can't I be here? I'll Why can't I be here? Cops are on the way. The cops are on their way. I can't stand here and be here or participate in the activity. It's a crime I'm doing. I'm a taxpayer. You need to leave. <laughs> Story time. The person that's doing the story time is a mephilian. If you've seen, they're very sexually exposed on social media and they have songs about uh, sexual activity and the kind of person they're dancing for children. <clears throat> what do you think about that, Sam? You what need to leave. leave. Why? What about yeah, you? I'm a tax paying citizen. They can agree outside. They have <laughs> they a right to protest outside. Parents that don't agree with, with this. Let's go talk outside. Oh, fine. I'm right here. I'm, I'm, I'm a tax paying citizen. Right here. There's rules in the library that I can't pass. This is, uh, I don't understand what they're doing. We can talk right here. I'm not a protester, I'm a taxpayer. So there's a dancer named Ophelia, and she's very provocative online, and she'll be talking to children today. Uh, if you can watch her on social media, I've already posted her content, and it's very disturbing content. And uh, this person... Go. Why don't you go? I'm a tax-paying citizen. We don't care. Go. You don't care. Yeah, so the yeah, city of St. Catharines... It's a private event. Let's go. Oh, I'm registered. Chloe Bigger. I'm a female. I'm a 12-year-old girl. I'm registered on the thing, you can see it. Okay. Yes, I am. I'm a 12-year-old girl. I identify as a 12-year-old girl. So you're going to be up a little girl? It's, uh, it's I'm a little girl. I'm a 12-year-old girl. You're not supposed to be a man. You have to yeah. just get out of here. I'm a, don't, I'm a woman. Please refer to my gender. Possibly you could use my pronouns. I'm a little girl. <clears throat> Children need Jesus. They do not need stories being read to them by gay people and transgender people. We need Jesus. This world needs God. Well, all that is here. what we, we need. No, I'm a little girl. I'm a 12-year-old girl. I identify as a little girl, so um, please respect me for who I am. I smell like alcohol. Oof. You're around kids. You smell like booze. Some of you guys does. Do you smell like alcohol? Uh, you smell you like alcohol. alcohol. We don't drink, dude. Are you... Well, I'm a little girl. I'm not a dude, so you just just know my pronouns. Are a little girl. Yeah. yeah. How are you doing today, sir? Good. You? Pretty. I'm doing excellent. Thank you. How are you doing today, sir? I'm doing great. Thank you. Thank you. I just came in the public library. I pay taxes. I just want to see what's going on down here. I'm documenting it. I'm a 12-year-old girl. I'm a 12-year-old girl. I got a 12-year-old girl. Yes, I do. Okay. This is the world we're living in. We identify yeah, so, as whoever we If you want, want to apprehend me or do anything, you have to call my parents for authority. I'm a 12 year old girl. Uh, might have, we have a, just a conversation? Yeah, we can have right here. Okay, so what is it that you're Did looking you to, to have happen today? Well, as a 12 year old girl, I am um, seeing this person's videos online. Her name is Ophelia, and she's very sexually prompted and it's very inappropriate for children. That's my concern. If this child's here to watch these. People dance and they're going to go search them up online and see what they actually do. If you watch the videos yourself, you'd actually be concerned if you were a parent. Okay. And so what is it that you're hoping to have? To show the world exactly what's going on with our tax dollars. Exposing our governments and 
who's protecting these people doing things that we do with our tax dollars. This is a government building, correct? Paid by a tax dollar funding. <clears throat> so I have a right to be here and film this. Okay. You just want to sit silently yep. in the back and watch? Yes, I do. Correct. And I won't raise my voice at all. I'll sit right there and videotape the whole thing. Okay. Um, and maybe the ladies in charge of organizing this. And as long as you're, uh, like you said, peaceful and just looking to kind of videotape this, yes. hopefully we can find some. Well, I've paid enough taxes in this town. I've lived here for a whole life, so. Right. Yeah, they might know me then. Yeah. No. Yeah. 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 They're gonna let me stay here. Why shouldn't I? I want to document what's going on in my hometown. This is my hometown, so. And that's the thing. If there's nothing to hide, we're not. We're not let the us people in and yeah. check it out and see what's going on. Exactly. There's nothing to hide. Well, the person that's Dan, the person that's doing the story time, I'm very concerned about their content online. Oh. Um, and if you watch their content, it's very inappropriate. Exactly. So my concern is that one of these children are now going to use their social media to go check this person out and see inappropriate content that they create. You understand my point of view, right? Oh, 100%. All right. That's why you're my mom. <laughs> That's right. Raise your right. Yeah. A couple backhands here and there, right? <clears throat> so we're here at the um, the the Pride Niagara Drag Show, and um, they were going to try to kick me out, but since I'm a 12 year old girl and uh, I identify as a little girl, I see how I've um, used their tactics. They're very good, and I'm very good at what I do. So. I feel, so, uh, feel so enlightened as a 12-year-old girl right now. I've never felt this fresh in my life before. So let's take a look at the books. <clears throat> We're going to read these books here for children. Mm. Mm. So further reading, I'll take one of these documents to do some further research at home. <clears throat> shake your bum bum, everyone. If you're a drag queen and you know it, shake your bum. And you really want to Shake your it. bum bum, yeah. Okay. My mom's going through the book to make sure that uh, as a 12-year-old girl that I'm uh, I'm able to see it. What do you think, Ma? Is this inappropriate for me as a 12-year-old girl? I would not show any It's like a South Park fucking thing. Right? Wow. South Park. Bam, bam. How are you, brother? I'm doing amazing. How are you doing today? Good to see you. Doing great. So what's going on here? Well, there's some books here. Um, they seem to be very inappropriate for children. One is, well, you can see them here. There's all types of things. Shake your bum bum. And we haven't just gone through the first book here. It's pretty crazy. There's individuals here that uh, are going to be exposing their child to a drag queen who um, has provocative and uh, very sexual videos online. My concern is that these children will see this person and then go on to social media. And the songs that this person sings is disgusting and inappropriate. Uh, any that is an adult, they're not, the song is terrible, let alone that this person is now speaking to children. So, it's a wonderful uh, event, not. Okay, so I spoke with the, um, the, the manager in charge okay. of the event. So what if, this is a, it was a ticketed event. So what that uh, means is you had to pre-register for it? I did, and Chloe Bigger. Yeah, I'm a 12-year-old girl, it's on there. You You're, can look it up. They have a list. Okay, I'll, I'd You're love not to see it. So it's a, a 60, the capacity of the room is 60 people. The event is sold out. You're not on the list, so unfortunately, for this event, you're not going to be able to be in the room. Having said that, you can hang out in the library. So, um, I would like you to do your own research. The person that's doing this activity, his name's Ophelia Online. Uh, so, I mean, as a, as a police officer, remember, uh, you should actually want to write my concerns down. And I, I want an investigation put but into we're this. We're going to have then. to talk outside. You can't be in this room, okay? I can't be in this room with tax paying The event hasn't well, like even started I said, yet. The capacity is 60. Well, it's not at 60 right the now. The event is sold out. Though. Okay. So I'm just doing some guys... documents of the books and stuff right now, and when it gets to capacity, I'll walk outside and talk to you. Listen. Yeah. Can I? Can we've I? Been, just one second. We've, 
I understand your concern. No, you don't. You're not doing anything about it. You guys I'm are trying to be, I'm trying to be reasonable. And I'm very... I'm, I've let you come in here. Yes. You've documented the books. Well, we're not See, done documenting the books. Okay. So give us the time to document the books. You've do seen our, what's going on. Well, I know, you know what's going on. I'm doing my due diligence as a parent and a taxpayer. Can I please just look at the books, captivate what I need from them, and then I'll how be much, on my way? How much time do you need? Give me five more minutes. I'll, put, I'll shake on. I'm a gentleman. No. I'm going to talk to these guys. They said it's a ticket event. They tried to prevent you from coming through the door. No, they didn't. I just walked in. They, they don't want you in here. Obviously anymore. not, because I'm exposing the evilness that's happening in this event. What Are I you need, a Christian man, Mr. Lindell? What I need from you guys is to put the books back. We can talk outside. I wanted to do a couple more pictures. I will book. document your concerns. Okay. I can write a report if that's what you want. Because the last event I went to, there was a Paul Shepard was in the audience. He's a known pedophile charged with. Uh, um, okay. And so Listen, these people here attending these events, dancing right. erotically, wearing women's clothing, and they're acting sexually online. And they're exposing themselves to children. We've already documented videotapes at the last one at, at, at uh, the park, and no one did anything. A man's actually genitals fell out in front of a child. You guys did nothing in the first floor. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to just have this conversation outside. I understand your concerns. You're bringing up points. I want to document them. So if we can talk out there, that's fine. All right. I'll, okay. I understand. Thank you. Appreciate that. I still have a question for you. But we, we got to talk outside. Okay. Listen. I, just just look through this book. Just lay yeah, Just you got to. We're trying to show you stuff, evidence of what's going on here. Okay. Well, take the book out. Can we take the book outside to show you some certain things? Concealing evidence. Centers. How are you doing today, sir? You're, you're proud of yourself? Unless you're super proud of yourself. Defending pedophilia? Probably you're one yourself. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. You are. You admitted to it online. There he is. That's why he's here defending this stuff. Pardon me? Exit's right over there. Well, then why don't you get out here? I'm not posing issues like that. What's my issue? I'm concerned that this person, Ophelia, has stuff online, very sexually, very provocative, very adult, and he's dancing on his Instagram, and now he's speaking with children? That's a very concern. I'm, I'm a taxpayer and a parent. What's your problem? You, you can be here, too, and voice your opinion. It's a freedom. It's freedom. You got a problem with freedom? Are you American or Canadian? I can't tell by your hat. I'm a North American man. Are you a supporter of pedophilia? I can't tell by your face. Oh, that's a yes. I have two children. Oh, I feel sorry for them. You're letting them get uh, indoctrinated by these people. Keep your judgments to yourself, man. No, no, I can do what I want. It's freedom of speech. That's not what Christ is like. That's not what Christ is Do you know Christ? Christ was Christ in there right now? I knew Christ for a very long time. Well, and why don't you get in there and tell them what they're doing is wrong? He's not like this, man. Well, I'm not Christ. I'm sorry to break it to you. I'm Josh Bigger. But if you're trying to be like Christ, you're not spreading these I'm not trying to be like Christ. I'm trying to be like me. I'm a Canadian, a concerned taxpayer, and a concerned parent. Just, just stop the hate, man. There's no hate. Stop the you're hate. the one saying that. I never said I hate anybody. I hate pedophilia. Yes, I do. Actually, you're right. I do hate pedophilia. Oh, God, let's hear this. Uh, come on. Those are hateful words, me standing up for the children's rights and innocence of children. This is a free country. Yeah, that's not a free country. I'm here. Yeah. So, that is talking. I'm talking. No, I don't want to go outside. You can go outside. This is the sexual abuse. And grooming of children, bro. This, this is, tell me how it's not. This is a free country. Can I say something? This is a free country. Well, you are allowed a free country. I'm allowed to do what I want. Yeah. You don't like it? Cry about it on his Facebook. I can film you all day if you don't want to be filmed. Like Police officers code. right here, they won't do anything. Like that's enough, eh? You know that's against our policy, right? Yeah. yeah. No recording on property. I'm not recording. Yeah, you are. No, no, I'm on Facebook Live. Yeah, well, still, it don't matter. Oh, well, that person's that's on their phone. Recording. That's recording. That's, that's recording. recording. You're on live. So either turn it off Bye. or turn leave. Or leave. Well, well, I, I think I'm allowed to record here. There's no policy. It's a taxpayer's uh, building here right now, and I paid my tax dollars here, and I'm going to talk to the police officer outside. It's the library. The library gets to set the policy. Our policy is... You call people idiots now. I'm just concerned about the children's safety and the innocence of children. Well, you can be concerned from the sidewalk if you want to keep recording. You seem pretty aggressive, sir. You're aggressive. You see, actually, I feel I feel intimidated by this gentleman. Oh, I'm sorry, man. He's getting in my face. I'm scared. Well, because, yeah, I need to enforce the rules. The rules are no recording on property. Well, police officer right here. I'm staying right here. It's a public area, but we're allowed to record it. Public event, we're allowed to record. Yes. Yes. He's a library member. So, uh, if you guys, we're gonna have you guys talk to just Mike over there. Yeah, no worries. Just like. That is okay.
being told that we're allowed to record right now. Oh, hey, huh? I'm just uh, protecting children and the innocents and my rights as a Canadian. Does that upset you, sir? I'm sorry, I'm sorry you got your feelings hurt today. But I'm here to protect the innocence of children, whether you like it or not. Are you upset about that, ma'am? Save our children. Good for you. It's right now the library guy is being told that we're allowed to film in here. Yeah, I'm trying to try and tell me what to do. Welcome to Canada. They can have a, a, a transgender stripper go talk to the kids about shaking his bum bum, but uh, I can't stand here and tell somebody that I think it's inappropriate and that protecting the innocence of children is a right thing to do. So I'm the bad guy here. How many vaccines you got? Just out of first it's a question. Boosters. How many boosters you got? I don't want to be on camera. You I don't care. I'm serious. I'm, I'm just asking a question. Well, there's gonna. Whoa, 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 whoa! Assault! Ow! Ow! Ah! Can you get him? Oh man, he touched me. My hand hurts. My hand. You see that? Please don't touch us. Wow! This guy's a tax. I pay for this building here. Yeah. Thank you. This is the kind of people to deal with. They, they get aggressive. They attack. And I just want to hear and film the document. What's going on here? Because it's wrong. So, Coming out. So now, what's the, what's the goal? The goal is to create awareness. Yeah, create awareness. That's exactly what we're doing. Is that a, is this a crime I'm doing? No, no. Oh, I'm okay. just asking. And why are we being harassed? Yeah. Well, you said you wanted to talk to me out here. Oh no, you want to talk to me out here. Yeah, I, I mean, want to get us out of there. And talk yeah, to us. yeah. Okay. So, 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 so we, we want to talk about. Okay, so the first of all, the One Pride Movement in Montebello Park, uh, um, an adult's penis fell out of his pants in front of seven children. Rob documented it. We have it. We sent it to you. You guys did nothing. There's the exposure of a male's genitals to children. And we, we documented it. We sent to you guys this information. Nothing's been done. This person here is online doing sexual content. Now, these children are going to watch this and go on Instagram and follow this person. His name's Ophelia. He's very sexual online. He sings a song about cutting dicks off and fucking little kids and boys if you want to have take the, the, the due diligence to go look at his video. That's not the can that we want to live in. Yeah. That's I got kids here. I got five kids. How many kids you got? So that's not the Canada we want to live in. I understand. Nine grade kids, buddy. Let's expose it. I, there you are. I, it's up to you guys. You guys, you guys are the ones that have the ability to help us stop this garbage. Yeah. But you see, right now, Josh, they're being told they can't do their jobs. Yes, unfortunately, you guys signed when you first became a police officer. Do you not swear an oath to protect the people? And. Is that not a true thing? Did you not swear an oath to protect the people and our rights and signal rights? Children are and children are minors, and the innocence of children should be protected at all times. Who's in there being victimized right now? Is this guy here dead touch me? So why isn't he it's being a, arrested? He, has, it's he it's grabbed my hand. It is why a isn't he not being? Or, it's a ticketed event. But why isn't he? So if we're following the friggin' rules, why isn't this guy being arrested for grabbing me right now? Oh my God! Can you want me to catch you off guard? Guy Fuck! So he's allowed to assault me? That you're here? So he just did it. I have it on film. And this is why I won't stop filming because I was a, I was accosted by this gentleman right here in front of three police officers that did nothing. I, I didn't see. Do you want me? Assault. You can watch it on the Facebook of Mr. Freedom. He grabbed my hand. Is he allowed to touch me? So he's allowed to touch me, and these people are allowed to expose themselves in front of children at Pride Week. That's the new rules for them, and not for and different ones for us. So my understanding is it is a ticketed event, right? But how does that make it okay? Well, people sign up to go to it. How many? This guy tried to steal my how phone many, from my hands. How's that okay? Six, yeah. How many people are in there now? Sixty? I didn't know. Are you sure? <laughs> but anyways, I think I can. I have this man charged with assault. He did. No, so we're not going to do the assault charge right we're now. Not we're not going to. So if I went and grabbed him by the neck, you'd have me arrested in the ground, beating the shit out of me. Because I was in Ottawa, and they pepper sprayed me, get the fuck out of me. You didn't let me. <laughs> I don't have to. Uh, I, I know the end result. So I'm no, not going to happen to yeah. these people. Can, they can expose themselves to children, and they can do whatever they want. I, I can give you my card. Please. Before you have the video, send it to me. Or I can be in touch with you, and we, we can go from there. And nothing will happen as usual. I'm not going to do the assault charge right now. I didn't see it. Okay, well we have it, it live. As you can actually, we can have it right I here got for it right you. Here if you want, want to see it. He grabbed, tried to grab the phone out of my hand, attempted theft, assault, whatever it would be. If I went and touched any of those people, you would have me on the ground, pepper sprayed, zipped up and in the back of your car in no time. And that's a fact. That's factual information there. What if? They videotaped it, yeah. Hey, we're paying your guys tax, uh, tax is paying for you guys too to sit there and promote this and they can assault and get naked in front of kids, but we can't, uh, we can't uh, use these rules to help us. That's great. Good. No wonder if people, you know what this government's going to do to you guys? If the country's so broke, there's going to be no pension left for you. There's nothing left for you guys. This country's going downhill. We're in debt so far, and you're standing up for them? Do you remember three short years ago when they're trying to get rid of you guys? And I actually sponsored you guys. I was protecting the boys in blue. Supported you. the role 
hear of me. I know, but, but you've got to start getting loud. Humanity? We got to. I, do you understand? You, you're, you're a man. I'm trying to be respectful of what you guys are up. trying to do. Stand, stand up with us, then. Stand beside, beside us. Uh, stand beside us and protect these children, man. Do you think this is right in there? Do you honestly, honestly, do you believe this is right? You do you understand my role here today. And if you say anything, you lose your job. You have a different opinion right? what they want you to have. To serve and protect the public. So a children isn't a child isn't considered a public. Do you not think that it's, do you think, like, I know you don't think this is okay, because I can see it in your face, I can see it in you, man. This is drive. I know, I know, and you see it on you. You're a good guy. Thank you. And you're stuck, and you're stuck in a rut, you don't know what to do, because you've got to get a paycheck. Yeah. That's what you're doing. $500,000 okay. mortgage with the interest hey, rates going up. Thanks. Love you as you're going to be. Thank you. But you know what? I hate what's going on right now. It's not right. And you know it in your soul and in your being, you say, right? And that's why you're blushing right now. And that's why you can't look me in the eye like a man. Look me in the eye and you tell me this is okay. Look me in the eye and you tell me this is okay. Would you bring your kid to this event? Thank you, sir. Thank you. You said that. Demonic. I'm listening here and document. There's no point in going any further. You're not going to press charges against the person who assaulted me. And um, I respect you, but uh, I don't respect what the government's making you do. <laughs> It's like the Eminem song. Your hands are sweaty. Hands Mom's are sweaty. spaghetti. Absolutely. Right? <laughs> I'm also I also I'm comedian too. So do your thing. I'm, I'm going to sit here and document a little bit. I'm not going to stay for the full event. Okay. Um, I'm not going to stay until it's over. But um, I'm just going to show. I'm just here to show the people uh, what's actually going on. And I have a duty to do as a parent. And I and I appreciate. I didn't want to. Sorry. I, I feel your pain, bro. I know. I know. I know. Yeah. I understand. I understand. I appreciate being respectful. Yeah. You're allowed to uh, be in this room. I look forward to the day, though, when you do stand beside us. I'll be waiting for that day patiently. I'll get a big hug. I've given out more, well, 400,000 hugs were in this coat. Never got COVID once. So this is like its own vaccine. You want, you want, a, you want a little vaccine? All right. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Alright, well, there's a law to uh, not get assaulted either, so we're going to go stick with the actual laws that got assaulted. Yeah, I, I, I told you how So, where's that guy? Can he be removed from the expressions? So, there is a. Uh, you guys have. Why am I Don't even ask for it. Why you're here. Yeah, and as, yeah we have. I, do it every, I go to every event. I know it's right. I, know, so. I have a part to do as a father and a Canadian citizen. How much longer they want, they want you to be Well, I got to take my daughter to the. Um, the horse barn for uh, exactly. you know, do dad stuff. So I'm not going to be here all day. I'm not going to have my kids exposed to this sexual predator. How, how, long, how long do you plan on, on being here? I'm probably going to be heading out in probably 20 minutes. Because um, library... I'm not going to wait around for the, to see the I people again. The library has... They just have concern because they have their court on them. Except for this. It's supposed to be quiet in the library. There it is right there. Not disruptive. There it is I just got it. I just had it. Yeah. So I'll send it to you. You can send it off. And then, okay. And then I'll take your card then. I'll, I'll get out of here. I didn't, my, my job here is done. Yeah, I'll, I, yeah, I'll take a card, sir. And I'll... Can we walk to the, the toy thing? Sure. Yeah. And then I'll can. give you my card. Thank you. Yeah. Why yeah. Why <laughs> He's like, fuck yeah. Oh. Guys. One little thing. Say goodbye. Come on. Bye. I just said goodbye. Give you my, Want a hug? I'll give you my card. No, I know. Okay. Anyone need a hug? Anyone need a hug? Why would I wear a real one? It's cruel. You know, this is an American. This is an American. Course. He lost. It's a trigger hat. It's, you guys like? You guys are so comfortable with outfits. Did you? Canada, I did. Yeah. 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 Bye. That's a trigger. Just get you guys upset. That's what I do. Remember, Jesus loves you. Bye. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Good. Hey, bring it in. Support, buddy. Yeah, buddy. God bless you. I'm getting out of here, though. I'm gonna take my daughter to the uh, horse barn. But uh, <clears throat> can I ask this guy a quick question? How many boosters you had, buddy? Just asking for my online. How many boosters? <laughs> How many boosters? <laughs> All right, guys. How many, how many boosters? <laughs> you guess at home, people. Don't worry, it's safe and effective. <laughs> I love you, buddy. I love you too, brother. <laughs> I love you. All right, well, I'm going to go uh, do normal things with my children. Yes. And, uh... Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs>
All, uh, we have the documented assault. Since the start of all this shit, and we ain't going nowhere. And we're not going nowhere. I know. Okay? I'm a victim of this. This is why I'm with her. Yeah. Please yeah, tell the story. I'm a survivor of this. Ten years of my life, grooming, sexualization. Thought it was normal. This isn't normal. He's a victim. I, I I'm a survivor, bro, not a victim. And that's why I'm here for these victims in here. Because that's what's going on. God bless you, bro. Give me. Bring it in. Hey, guys. Oh, you're getting car. They're gonna clean me out here. Yeah, yeah. It's our taxpayers. Uh, it's our taxpayers. Yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, not many people answer. Appreciate it. You've been really quiet. Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. All right, can I get a handshake at least? Count? No, a handshake. We do handshakes, handshakes around here. We're... Men shake hands. Men shake hands. hands. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your patience. And uh, that's what I wanted to do. I'm here is cause awareness. Have a great day, gentlemen. All right. So that concludes our visit to the public library where they're promoting sexualization of children. They have a drag queen named Ophelia. You can look at my past video. Where she has a very erotic video talking about cutting dicks off, sucking dick, fucking, and banging little kids, uh, little boys and girls, it says in the song, which she's dancing to and mimicking the words to. So if you want uh, your children exposed to this type of satanic um, and pedoph pedophilic bullshit, you can come down to the St. Catherine's uh, Centennial Public Library and you can... Uh, host an event with satan himself but uh i wore my trigger hat today to piss off the uh the people today They're like it worked <laughs> hey, hey if you, can, if you can wear a dress and dance for kids why can't i wear a trump hat hey? i'm more of a north american anyway guys you got to get out here and do this shit in your hometown these people are doing this all over the place and uh it's literally disgusting and uh, i don't know why no one's standing up for this it's, it's disgusting hey sweetheart how's it going oh good i'm going home now i just came to uh, my mind. Hey, bring it in. You're not allowed to do that. Yeah, I know you're allowed. Sherwin Williams, I love their paint. That's what our diamond shingles are made with. Yeah, right on. Big time. Yeah. All right, thanks for coming, buddy. Bit of a shit show. <laughs> no, no, they just uh, we got what we wanted, right? Just exposure and showing people what's going on. They would let us in for the show, though. But anyways, guys, I'm uh, I'm out for the day. Uh, I got to hang out with the fam jam. So God bless you all. Stay strong. Fight Satan. If you see Satan later, tell him to go fuck himself. <laughs>